Hey guys, thank you for tuning back into my channel. My name is Vail Dog. This is my kitchen where I'll be teaching you how to make affordable restaurant quality foods or better from my home to yours. So stay tuned in and let's get cooking. Okay guys, I'm back and today on the chopping block, we just, as you can see, we have wings. And today I'm making two different type of wings. I'm making a honey garlic wing and a Parmesan garlic wing, okay? And these are the ingredients you're going to need. You need some black pepper. Now this is grounded, really um, fine black pepper right here. This is cayenne pepper and adobo. Of course, you need the red hot um, sticking honey garlic uh, hot sauce. And you need the Parmesan. Uh, great value if you get, you can buy the other one if you want to. Um, all these products came from um, Walmart. So this is a great value, Parmesan and garlic wing sauce, okay? And I'm gonna be cooking it in my new wave oven. All right, so let's get to it. Okay guys, I am back and all we're gonna do is just take these wings, put them on here. This is like a family size of Tyson wings. Just fit them on the best way you can. I forgot to cut that one up. I was kind of like rushing because it's a super bowl. So this shouldn't take no more than about 45 minutes to get done. A lot of them in here. Normally I could fit um, the whole pack on here. I'm just not stacking them the way I should be stacking them. <laughs> Hopefully I can stack them um, after I season both sides. It's a tight fit though, but they cook out. They cook pretty evenly. Okay, that's the whole pack right there. All right, let me get rid of this bowl. All right, let me scoot this out the way. We're gonna go first with the adobo. We're gonna use like a teaspoon on each side, maybe a tablespoon. I think it'd be like a teaspoon, pretty much, because uh, it's pretty um fine seasoning and we'll come with the um, cayenne now if you don't have no just regular cayenne you can also use um, like the Tony's season the Creole season yeah we just want a little spice to it and go with the black pepper. So that cayenne, I would say like a teaspoon of that. And a teaspoon of this black pepper. Just flip them over. So how are you doing? I'm not going to worry about that one. Someone's just going to get lucky. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm back, I just turned them, my phone was ringing, so we'll go with this teaspoon on this side, or the tablespoon rather, I would say teaspoon, really pretty much, just to be on the safe side, because this do have a lot, of, I mean not a lot of salt, but it has some salt into it, so I would say a teaspoon on each side, instead of a tablespoon, because it's pretty fine. All right, well, we got the cayenne pepper. We want it spicy now. Black pepper. If you don't want yours too spicy, then uh, just reduce it. At your discretion. So. Alright, I think that should be do it. Alright, take you guys over there and I'll see you in a minute. Okay guys, I'm back. Alright, let's see what we're gonna do here. I'll tell you every time I get to mess with this, I don't mess with the often. So that's why I'd be like, what the what 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 the what? <laughs> so we're gonna put cook time, which is a 350. Then we wanna put it in there for what? I would say uh we're gonna time it at 40 minutes. 
It ain't gonna take that long. I ain't gonna even time it at 40 minutes. Really. It ain't gonna take that long. That's gonna be the total cooking time, guys. I'm gonna do 20 minutes. Cooking time, 20 minutes. I don't even think I did that right. Let's do it again. Cooking time. Cook time. Nope. Minutes. Yep, so you gotta push cook time and then start. And there you go. Alright, I got too many gadgets. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, this is the new wave oven. And it, I, I, I really do. They ain't endorsing me or nothing. But I really encourage people to go get one. Is everything what they um, said on them infomercials. It makes your food taste better too. And then it, less grease is much healthier for you. Alright, so I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, guys, I'm back. There's about one minute left on it. I'm just going to go ahead and flip these over and um, cook it for about 15 more minutes on the other side. So it'll be uh, 45 minutes whole cooking process. So I'm just going to go ahead and stop this one. Put that to the side and turn these over. And I'll show you what we'll be doing next after that in a minute. Okay, guys, I'm back. Let's go ahead and turn this off. I think they've done enough for me. Ooh, tighten it on there. <clears throat> okay, we're going to take half of these out because I'm going to um, mix it up with that, um, that honey garlic first. About enough, right? We're gonna mix that up. All we're gonna do is, so we're just gonna squeeze some of this on there. I want to say about two or three tablespoons. We don't want a lot on these. We just want to taste. So make sure all of them get some on there. Like almost like a glaze, like. Toss this up. Okay, guys, I'm back. I did toss those up, and these are those right there. Okay, that's how those look. Now we just gonna go ahead and do these. Take these and put them in the same bowl. See all that grease in there? That's why I say get you one of these new waves. All right. Taste that little piece. Mm-hmm. Right on point. Mm-hmm. All right, where the sauce at? Okay. You gonna pick up some of this Parmesan um, garlic salt right here. We're just gonna put some in there. That should be enough. I'm gonna toss that around in there. Okay. That tastes real good. Mm. Mm, I'll feel like put some more Parmesan on there. I ain't putting none of that on there. That's it. <laughs> I ain't putting nothing else on there. That tastes really good, super good. Now the other one tastes good too. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and plate this up and I'll show you guys what we got in a minute. Okay guys, I am back. <clears throat> All right, here we got it right here. You got the Parmesan and garlic wing right here. And right here you have the honey garlic by Red Hot, Frank's Red Hot. And it was done in a new wave oven. So you guys jump on these wings they are excellent tastes super good all right tasted it um just go ahead and check it out and please give me a like a share and please subscribe to the channel and tell all your friends and family to come over to veil dog kitchen and find out what we doing together it ain't just about me it's about you guys too and please hit that bell 
please hit that bell for me and let me know who you guys are and welcome to the family. And I'll see you guys next time in Veil Dog's Kitchen. Let's get cooking.